Time for the Bias Sports Report. Major League Baseball is investigating Alex Rodriguez and his involvement in an alleged illegal poker ring involving several celebrities, including uh, uh, Spider-Man, Toby, what's his name? Uh, the guy who died on the Titanic, the guy who uh, fell in the water, DiCaprio, right? The guy who made that really bad movie with Jennifer Lopez, Ben Affleck, and uh, Matt Gaiman. He's in there, too. You know what? If Pete Rose got banned from baseball for gambling, <laughs> why don't they toss A-Rod, too? Boom, out of here. Can't stand A-Rod. I hate when he does an interview. Before he speaks, he always goes like this. That's like the worst noise in the world. If you ever make that noise when talking to someone, well, you suck. Don't do that noise. Shea Weber was awarded $7.5 million in arbitration money for this season, which uh, could bankrupt the Nashville Predators. Does this arbitrator realize that the Predators are a hockey team that plays in Nashville? They can't afford to pay one guy that much money. They're going to have to get a loan from Kerry Underwood to pay Weber's contract. I don't think Kerry's going to do it. The list of the richest female athletes was released. Maria Sharapova tops the list at $25 million a year. It's not bad. Caroline Wozniacki, who's a tennis player or something, she's number two at $12.5 million. And the uh, sensational Danica Patrick is in third spot at $12 million. That's a pretty hot uh, top three right there. Then Venus Williams comes along at number four. So we'll just stop right there. Speaking of Danica, this is uh, interesting. You know how sometimes ladies decide to experiment and switch teams? Well, she's thinking of doing that. She uh, she wants to move from IndyCar to NASCAR, so she's she's looking to maybe do both at the same time. That's uh, kinky. NASCAR and IndyCar. Wild stuff, Danica. Toronto is slowly starting to get more awesome as they're introducing the Bikini Basketball League. Not sure if you need to be good at basketball to play in that league. Maybe just look good in a bikini. I don't know. What will this do to the WNBA, though? I don't know. If there's a bikini basketball league, people are, aren't going to watch the NBA anymore. Oh, no, wait. Nobody watched the NBA to begin with, so it's not really that much of a threat. The bikini basketball league coming to a uh, town near you, I guess. Maybe Sunshine Girl Jesse will play in the bikini basketball league. She likes basketball and was once a man. <laughs> it looks like She looks like Prince. She does. She, her face looks like Prince. I hate to be judgmental, but you can't be a sunshine girl and look like Prince without somebody pointing it out. She's Prince with less purple on.